Hi everyone, it's Kronos and in this video I'll be talking about the new incarnation. So I'll be showing the thunder one. I was able to pull two. So this one has no thunder incarnations. This set has one incarnation and the last one has two. So it says it increases lightning attack by 20% and lightning attack Maggie charge speed by 10%. So the reason I'm not using the Abaya sword and shields as well for this video is because here it says Maggie charge rate by 10%. So that sort of, oh, whoops. So that sort of makes this whole test a bit unfair. Okay, so let's start with the uh, no incarnation. So I'll be showing the. I'm not so sure if the Maggie charge speed would change a lot, but I will be showing the. What will I be showing? I'll be showing the damage and stuff. So, what behemoth would be fine? I'll go Gaia Froggid. Okay, so this is the one that has no Thunder Incarnations. And what it does, it says 20%, so it won't be like, if you have many, it won't be 20%, then the next 20% would be 20% of that 20%, it would just be 20% of your original. I think. So... That grab does 226 damage, and the last hit does 2500. Okay, I guess I would have to do normal combos for the thun so you can see thundering mouse bomb charge speed, but. I'll do this to charge thundering mouse storm up. But anyway, the charge speed isn't too bad. Okay, so here it is. 60,000 60, damage with uh, with one incarnation. Okay, now let's just get rid of you. Okay, now I'll be back with the two incarnate one incarnation set. Okay, so here I am with the one incarnation set. Same Maggie's, I think. Yeah. So, let's go. I guess I'll also put pictures up at the end to compare the damage. Or not compare, but like to show the damage. Okay, once this thing decides to load. Okay, so. Now that Claude does. Uh, I don't know the damage difference but anyway there you go so that felt like it charged a bit faster sort of annoying how the soul sword and shield doesn't have a roll attack So it feels like it charges a bit faster and then this. Why? <laughs> okay, we'll have to do this one again. Yeah, so that took quite a while to do because I kept hitting weak markers. That frog was really annoying. But anyway, wait, am I using... Yeah, this is the one with three thunder incarnations. What? Okay, it's a bit weird. It says 2,500 attack here, but only 2,493 there. But anyway, that was quite irritating. But you know, I'm going to leave once and then go back in. So I hope the same doesn't happen here. So with two thunder incarnations. With two, it should be like... The speed of having one to buy a sword and shield because if you get perfect rolls, you should get like 16% faster Maggie charge.
So now the hook does 236 damage. Okay, perfect. I hit a weak, so right as it gets up. 63,000. And to be honest, I was when I saw 20% more, I was expecting like... I was expecting something like a lot more damage, so 20% of 60,000. I'm sorry, I haven't done maths in a while, see? And what 30 is 50%. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> My math isn't too good now. What, wouldn't it be like 12? 12,000 more? 12... 6,000 more. 12,000 more, yeah. I was expecting it to do like 6... My, with one ten percent with one twenty percent more thunder damage I was expecting it to do Okay to work out sixty thousand and to work out twenty percent of this you do times it by zero point two. Yeah twelve thousand. I was expecting it to do seventy eight thousand more Whoops, I was expecting it to do 78,000 more damage, but anyway, I'll put up the damage numbers next to each other so you can see. That was all for this video, hope you guys enjoyed, bye.